Hello everyone, it's DA here. Hope you guys are doing amazing. Hope you guys are doing okay. So while I was playing Warframe a few hours ago, I realized something because of course after I got bored and you know I didn't have anything to do, I decided to go on into the settings and start tweaking some things, going on and checking out my inventory and looking at some of the different features in the game and it came into my understanding that we have a lot of items and of course even some features in the game that either we do not use or not a huge amount of people use them and then that becomes a question of should de just go ahead and remove those features or should they just leave it in there and just let it fill up some space and of course result in additional download space and one of the ones and one of the items that i saw on this list was the flappy bird zephyr thing and i must be honest with you when that thing first came out when zephyr first came out and they first had that slappy bird, uh, flappy bird feature. It was one of the most amazing things ever because you know we've all played that game on our phone, on our Android, on our on our iOS as well. It was one of those amazing games that we've ever played because you can pass time with it. But having that game within Warframe itself is just not as efficient as you would want it to be, mainly because. This is a game you have to play either on your laptop, on your desktop computer, or maybe on your PC, or well, of course, PC is your laptop, or maybe on your console. And a game like Flappy Bird or Zephyr Bird is one of those things where you really need to have that game in your hand for you to really enjoy it. Because we play games like this whenever we go to the doctor's office, whenever you're in the waiting room, whenever you're having a hospital visit, or whenever you're trying to pass some time. So you go ahead, reach into your back pocket, your wallet or your purse for the ladies, and you just pull this out and of course you go on and start gaming and you pass time, you take away some boredom, and this is one of the best I and mean, amazing thing that happens whenever you have a game on your phone. However, having that on a big screen that is sitting on your computer when you have other games that are a lot much entertaining, or you have it on your console where you have other games or other things you could have been doing like either maybe watching Netflix or so. It is very, very much not one of those things where you use or you do to entertain yourself. Another one that I saw on there is the grand finale fireworks thing. And I remember when that feature was first introduced into the game, every time I get to the exit, I always pop it off in my gearbox and all that kind of stuff. And, you know, I just shut it into the sky, Valentine's Day event. It was amazing. It was like the most amazing thing to me at that point in time. However, after we started having a whole lot of more items that fills up the gear slot, it becomes more and more in a, put in a situation where we have to squeeze it out because... We have different utilities and different features that we need, you know, and of course, this may be one of those things where for a new player, it could be a very, very good thing. You know, it could be fun. It could be entertaining. It could be an enjoyable thing. However, when you start reaching the veteran status, when you start crossing from mastery rank eight and above, a lot of these things start being fun to you. You start on equipping them in your load out you start putting other things in there things that are much more important like your shield regeneration or maybe your energy restore or maybe your health regeneration things you start using those or maybe your scanner you start having those in your gear slots and these things and these items put features like the fireworks in the back burner and pretty much put them in a spot where nobody or anybody hardly use them another one will be the remote observer and this is one of those items that became obsolete because a lot of people tend to use them at a point in time to take screenshots for YouTube videos or maybe, you know, they're trying to create some kind of artwork or some wallpaper. However, this is one of those things that have, is becoming obsolete. I don't want to say it has become obsolete since the introduction of the Captura scene. The fact that we can now rotate cameras and move around in our Captura scenes and record video make this really really obsolete and i know when it gets to that point de will also release another feature for the capture scene where you can record while you're making movements or you're creating different motions which puts the remote observer in a space in a situation where it's pretty much useless because 
you don't need it anymore to get your best shots you don't need it to get the amazing screenshots because you now have something better and something more useful and something with a lot much freedom for you to take your amazing screenshots or record some of your amazing cinematics and some of your amazing videos in the game so let me know in your own opinion what you think and what items or what features in the game do you think is useless do you think D should just go ahead and take it out or even in some situations if you think D should just leave them in there let me know down below in the comment section if you love and enjoy this video give me a thumbs up and if you would love to see more on this channel hit that subscribe button as always it is DA signing out I'll see you in the next one.